Hey you guys, Ambassador Diamond here with It Works Global Amber Parker. And I just wanted to uh, make a quick video for you guys on how to use the Wow. It's incredible. It's one of my greatest products that I love to use. But it's a little bit tricky. And so I wanna make a very clean, clear video for you guys so you know how to use it better and have greater results. So the Wow is called Wipeout Wrinkles, okay? And it comes in little packs like this, okay? So what you do when you get your box is you're gonna make sure that your face is clean, okay? That you don't have any makeup on. I've already toned my face, I've used my exfoliating peel, and um, I've toned my face and um, also used my, um, my repairage as well. So making sure that you're using all the products go hand in hand is really important, okay? So I have my wow, and what you have to do first is activate it. So I'm gonna be quiet and you're gonna hear how I can activate it. It's actually pretty cool because you wanna activate the ingredients. And so you just kinda of wanna, it kinda of sounds like Pop Rocks. And you just wanna activate it. So that's how you activate it. You can also just kinda of rub it together like this. So you just wanna activate it and make sure that it's activated, okay? All the ingredients together. You use a little bit. A little goes a very long way with this product. So um, then you open it, okay? You're gonna use your middle finger. Um, it's the safest to use, especially around your eyes. And so I have a very minimal amount. Um, it's not very thick. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna go under your eye and you have about five to 10 seconds to really play with it. Now you can see how it's a little bit wet. I don't want that. So I'm gonna use a different finger and kind of wipe some of that off. And then you wanna hold your posture. You don't really want to move around so much. Um, and you wanna make sure that it's just um, about dries for uh, 45 seconds to two minutes. Just let it dry, let it dry. And then um, you'll start to see that it's gonna tighten and it's gonna freeze. And so then I have the rest of my packet. What am I gonna do with that rest of the packet? You don't wanna waste it, okay? So what I usually do is me and my husband usually split a pack, but I also um, can fold it and use it at night. So there's two different um, blends in here that help with short-term immediate results and long-term um, results as well. So then at night, wash your face, come in and apply it all over your eye. Now here's the thing. What I want to share with you guys is if you use too much, it's going to turn white and chalky. Okay. And so I'm going to apply a little bit on my hands so you guys can see what the white chalky that I'm talking about. Okay. Um, or if you play with it too much. So if I'm, um, you know, going to sit here and keep touching it and going like this for 10 or 15 minutes and then it's gonna turn this white chalky. I can feel it tightening my eye, okay? So I'm gonna try and hold my posture and still do this too, but you don't wanna be smiling and you know make those wrinkles come back, but you can apply this all over your face. Um, so it's kind of hard to get it white and chalky, so if you get it white and chalky, you're using way too much, okay? So like I said, less is always more and um, it takes about five to 10 minutes before it actually turns really white and chalky. So don't apply this right as you walk out the door so you know whether, you, whether or not you use too much. But what I love is that if it does, if you use too much, that's not a problem. What you're gonna do is let's say that my eye was super white and chalky and it's been 10 minutes. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna grab a little bit of our uh, repairage or lip and eye cream and I can just kind of blend it right in and it'll remove any chalky residue that I have. So again, if that does happen, it's not a problem. Just apply a little bit of moisturizer cream right on top of it. You don't wanna wash it off or use water or try to rub it in. All you're gonna do is take a moisturizer and just blot it. Now you can apply this over your uh, makeup as well. It's obviously not gonna be as affected. It's gonna go through your makeup. But if you do, if you're forgotten, if you're wanting to do your makeup, that's totally fine. Um, if you apply, depending on what foundation you use and if it's a powder or if it's a cream, um, it will change the intensity of it. So you wanna make sure that you are really applying it after you've exfoliated, after you've um, moisturized your face, toned it, and, um, and then apply it onto your face for the best results. So again, um, I mean, you can kinda of see, maybe not, you can see that little white line right there where it gets a little chalky. Now, I put a lot on my arm, but um, you can see that it just turns turning a little bit white and chalky. All I'm gonna do is apply a little teeny, teeny, teeny bit. I'm almost out, I love this stuff. 
a little bit of um, repairage on my hand. So, oh, there you go. Now you can see it. See how it's turning all white and chalky because I used way too much. All I'm going to do is just rub a moisturizer cream right over it and it will blend that all in. Great results, right? So you can even tell a difference in just my hands in the way that it feels. So it, it really does work powerfully. It's a two minute product, it's amazing. Um, check it out and you will love it.